So these seats have this handy little feature here. They've got a little USB uh, cable plug-in so you can recharge your phone. But um, I got the new Mac and it runs on this stupid USB-C cable. So, um, <clears throat> you know, I wanted to power that too. And this little USB port. And here's a little USB port to charge your phone, but there's only one and there's two of us. And plus I want to charge my laptop too. So, put this in there. See that hole right there? My little uh, Harbor Freight. I got this at Harbor Freight. Didn't really have it have a use for it at the time, or didn't really have a need for it at the time. But ended up picking it up, and it came in handy this time around. So, just drilled a little hole in there and routed this uh, USB charger. Well, this thing's kind of warm, and it will charge the new Mac. There you go. And then we have wires strewn around the place, and I trip on them. So as I was modifying the chair to include the USB-C adapter, I realized that the chair is really loose. Why is that? So um, I opened it up. I needed to do this anyways because I need to route the power cord in here. Just pulling those staples. What is this piece here? Why is it that loose? Man, the quality is lacking in this RV furniture. Look how loose this is. I think I need to reinforce it. Actually, it looks like I could just tighten it. For some reason, it became loose. Um, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and tighten it and see if that fixes things. But the point here is the quality. The quality is lacking. Come on, Montana. Get with it. All right, we have got the phone inside of the chair. Those are the cup holders right there. And this is the missing part here. This bolt is loose. Why is so loose? So here's the problem. On this side, they're facing up, and then this chair snaps into it this way coming down, facing down but on this side they are the opposite they're facing down so on this side they are facing down and so when you lean on this side uh, it doesn't whatever so on this side you start to like rock over to the right side and it's because these are facing down, whereas on this side, they're facing up. So if it was designed the same on both sides, then I wouldn't have this problem. I cracked the case, guys. Are you proud of me? I figured out what the problem was. I, uh, it's going to take some modifications. It's also going to take some patience and willingness on my part, and uh, I just don't have that right now. I just wanted my USB-C adapter. Thanks for watching.